hey how's it going so today we're going to talk about creating a course from an existing video so you got a video that you did that explains something and you want to create a course from it now you could just take that video and just post it on YouTube on Facebook and just tell people go watch this video right and maybe it's a 30 minute hour long video and it's got everything that they need to learn whatever it is you're trying to teach but the thing is that a single video like that is really not the ideal way to show somebody how to do something if you're doing online courses you really want to split it up you want to have an introduction you want to have you know the the part one and part two and part three and you want to show these different things in in, in smaller bits so that they can learn the pieces that you're trying to teach them in a sequence and they can go back to part one when they when they're on part five and they don't remember what it said about part one they can easily go find it right instead of having to tell them go to minute 4 45 and go to minute 50 and go to minute 23 <coughs> and all that right so we're going to show you how to do that how to split a course how to create a course from a video in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so obviously there's a bunch of different ways to do this but let's start with the basics so you got a course you got to decide what the topic is of the course you got to decide how are you going to split it up then you got to have the recorded video so if you already have a recorded video that's the, obviously we're starting from that so for me what I'm going to do is yesterday my episode was about creating a course right so I actually want to have on my platform I actually want to have a course on how to create a course so that's what I did yesterday I recorded an episode where I showed you how to create a course and it's a it's a 30 40 minute long video right that has all the all the sections in it. it talks about how to create the course how to add lessons how to set up your profile all these different things and it's basically a course on how to create a course on click eCourse right so I'm going to use that as the as the as what I'm trying to do so I'm just going to go share my screen here and show you what uh <coughs> so the click eCourse site <coughs> obviously you're going to have to be already registered you're going to have that account right now we're just going to go and log in as myself and I'm going to go and create this course that I'm actually going to it's actually going to be a course that I want uh, people is to be able to use to learn how to create a course on click eCourse right and we're going to make it I'm going to make it available and make it uh, visible so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and create a course oh I have to log I have to reload the page so under courses right here I'm just going to go into courses I'm going to go and create a new course and we're going to call this course it's going to be called ha uh, creating your first your first course so first I'm just going to actually <clears throat> create the course uh learn the steps to creating an account whoops creating an account an account and a course on Click eCourse okay so this is specifically for my site obviously but I mean that's the idea is I'm creating a course and I'm going to use a video that I did already and I'm going to show you how to create a course from that so <clears throat> so we're going to uh we're going to say uh, this if to create a course on click eCourse so obviously what you put here is going to be based on whatever course you're creating uh course on click eCourse you'll you'll need to set up an account an account and uh, publish the course lessons and this simple course shows you how all right so I'm going to just click on next over here down here <coughs> I don't I'm not going to worry about the engine codes I'm going to create a course I'm going to create a course image I'm actually going to go and let's just say open a new tab here 
a new tab and what I'm going to do is I'm going to say mm, let's do a screenshot of this go over here just just put this like this doesn't really matter I'm going to save that as a and obviously you want to have a proper a proper uh, image and everything else you're creating a course I'm not we're not going into the details of the actual uh, course so course header or course or whatever and I'm going to go back to here I'm going to set that as the file I'm wanting to use this one here next the price is going to be zero obviously downloadable sure embedded no access I'm going to make it unlisted for now and uh, sites I want it on all the sites <coughs> all right so now I've created this course it's a course and there's no lessons so what we want is we want to first we want to create the separation so let me see if I can't it's probably going to so there's different ways to take your video so I have my video right here that I actually did yesterday let's just bring it over here so this is the video oops what happened here okay so this is the video that I did yesterday of the of the of of creating a course right so I'm just going to go in here I'm going to go find where my introduction is let's turn the sound on um, the the logo uh, picture up here that if you click on ends up taking you to this page uh, so obviously you had to use the plug and a lesson it might be maybe available and then the play here you just talk, like, talk to go there you need to be able to receive go there register forward you'll see there's a talk up and like go to the site you're just going to this thing to actors have here you can see the those button was <clears throat> well this is not working out the way I was hoping I I should have so basically what you want to do is you want to take a, a video right and you want to take the pieces of the video out separate them into less <coughs> into lessons <coughs> and what I'm going to do right now is I'm actually just going to show you how to do it from the command from the way I I do it on the computer uh I have a site that's remote here which because uh, my internet isn't fast enough to do this so I'm going to go here <coughs> so I've got this video here uh that I have of the uh, you can see kind of the I'm 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 a programmer so this is I'm just going to do this like this um and that's going to be the input is going to be the original video and I'm going to just say uh, C copy minus two uh, let's say uh, one, 15 <clears throat> and it's going to be intro mp4 okay so I'm going to create an intro so now I have an intro and I'm going to do the part one part one and part one is going to be skip to there let's say 125 and two will be three minutes and then we're going to do a part two just be, obviously we want to make sure that this is <coughs> the the right thing it's got to be the right you know uh okay so I've got the videos now what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload them to YouTube and I want to upload the, the the three led the three parts right so I'm going to upload the introduction um is it down here no it's over here I got my intro my part one and my part two I'm just going to upload all three of them so we're uploading those to YouTube I'm just uploading them to YouTube and it's uploaded and then I just go in here and I can edit this this is introduction introduction and of course you don't necessarily have to put a description in there or anything like that right but um you might want to uh 
put something in here so people ever go to YouTube to find it right but I'm just going to make this like this I'm going to make it unlisted there we go and I'm going to close that I want to edit part one I want to go uh, this is going to be part one let's just say part one so I'm uploading the videos now to YouTube right so the different sections of my course I'm going to make them unlisted and he's happy and then I'm going to make part two as well this is part two all right and this one is also going to be unlisted save it there okay so now I've got three videos of course you want to split it the right way you want to put the right the right things in your uh, in your course and we're going to go back here to the other screen where I had the uh, I guess I'll close that and I can close this too okay so now I have the course and I want to create the lessons I'm going to create the lessons here I'm going to call this the introduction introduction and what is this course about right and obviously in the introduction you want to talk about what the course is about uh let me see am I still sharing yeah okay uh and then you just put the url here of the youtube video so if we go back to my youtube channel <coughs> where I uploaded them okay my channel under my youtube studio okay so now if I'm in my channel I can see in my videos the three videos I just uploaded right now at the top of the list because they just got uploaded and I'm just going to use this introduction I'm going to say get shareable link I'm going to go back in here I'll make this one let's close that and this is going to be the url to it right here and now it's getting the video and it's putting it on the site right so now I go back to my list I see there's one of them I'm actually going to make this public right now published and I'm actually going to save that <clears throat> okay so back to the course now I have two I have one lesson here I'm going to create a new one just say uh up here I can say plus or I can use this but let's say plus lesson and this will be lesson two this is part one so how to set up so how to register register an account in this lesson we show you show you how to register your account on quick eCourse <clears throat> okay so we're going to choose a file no I'm not going to choose a file I'm going to go back here I'm going to go to part one which is the registering uh which is not what I wanted to do I just wanted to use the the link to it get shareable link go back over here and paste that in here and then save it so now we have the two lessons the first one is the introduction the second one is how to register your account and I'm going to go and create another one I can say add a new lesson right here and I'm going to put the third one or which is part two get shareable link and I'm going to go over here and I'm going to put that here like this this is going to be setting up your profile that's the second lesson I'm going to make it published right away save it <clears throat> all right so now that's there so now if I go back to the course now I have a course with three lessons from the from the you know from the the different pieces as you can see one is one minute 15 the other one's one minute 35 this one's one minute 45 based on what I cut out obviously I want to have a course with more you know if I if I go back because really what I wanted is I wanted to have uh 
the the course that I'm creating is how to create a course on Click eCourse right so the first thing is you want to reg you want to introduce what the course is about you want then you want to talk about in my case I want to talk about registering an account then I want to talk about um setting up your profile then I want to talk about becoming an affiliate this is actually what I did yesterday right the if I look at my let's show you the uh my blog here so the episode I did yesterday for my blog is this one how to create your first course on Click eCourse right so let's just go to that blog post and in that blog post I have my course that I want to create this is the this is it it's these things so I want to have these things right so register for a free account set up your profile so I'm actually the better way for me to do this would have been to actually create let's close that <clears throat> would have been to actually go here let's just move this around a little bit so what I want here is I want to create so let's say I know let's say I know that uh, I've got these four pieces right so I'm going to do that again I'm going to do the same thing here and I'm going to create so introduction introduction right I'm going to say it starts at 0 30 whoops let me just do that right here so all the way to let's say one minute uh 45 like obviously I have to make I have to go through the video and make sure I have the right uh sections but I'm going to do that here so then the another one is registering <coughs> that'll be <coughs> I just want to make sure I have the videos I should have done that before obviously 250 and this will be two so it'll be actually let's make it 450 okay so registering then the next one is setup profile <clears throat> this will be from four let's say five five ten to seven fifty seven thirty okay then I have uh become affiliate become affiliate is going to be <coughs> from 755 then I have the create course after you're an affiliate I want to create course so be from 10 25 to 12 20. all right and then I'm going to go add lesson so add lesson that's going to be from 12 40 to 15 20 and then the last one was publish course right so publish publish course is going to be to 22 15. all right so now I have all of these and I want to remove these videos here this intro I don't want anymore this one I don't want and now I have those ones <clears throat> now I can do the same thing I'll go to my YouTube I'm actually going to delete these delete yep yep I understand delete it uh, let's see this one here too delete I understand <clears throat> these are little things that right that take a while so delete forever all right now okay so now I'm going to upload those other those those other videos I'm going to have them all and actually you know what I should do I should rename them right they should be named based on the 
done over here back over here so m introduction is going to be number one now move I want to have the register register this will be two then I want to have this setup to be three then I want to have the become affiliate to be number four then I want to have the <coughs> create course to be five and I want to have the add lesson to be six and I want to have the publish course to be seven seven all right so now I have them named in a way that makes it easy to upload and to identify I'm just going to go like this I'm just going to upload all those to YouTube <coughs> he's uploading them all I'm just going to wait for them to be uploaded they're not taking too long actually you can't see that can you there so they're uploading as you can see right here you can't move that I guess anyways they're all uploaded and now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and edit them each of these I'm going to edit this one and I'm just going to leave it at that I'll just change it to have the uh, to be unlisted I'm going to edit them all to make sure they're all unlisted because that's the first thing you got to do takes a while right but still this is kind of the process right you got to go through this process you got to. you don't uh, by the way you wouldn't depending on the account you have you wouldn't have to upload them to YouTube necessarily you could actually just upload it straight to uh to 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 click eCourse still have a few almost done <coughs> oops is that not letting me edit it there you go just finish the editing here unlisted <coughs> oh my god sorry sorry about that I couldn't I couldn't prevent it okay so there's still another one draft for here okay so okay now are they all public unlisted 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 okay good okay so now if I go back to my other screen where I had the this over here I can reload this and now we have those now one of the things is that we just did is we replaced videos right so we replaced videos so now I want to use the introduction this introduction get here get shareable link I go back to my course I'm actually going to edit this one and I'm going to change the url to be this one here oops and save it <coughs> now that's going to upload update the update the video to use the new uh, the new video if I go back to the course now this second one is how to register I'm going to edit this as well I'm going to make it published here and then I'm going to go to number one number two registering get shareable link change that here save it okay it's saving back to the course the number three is setting up your profile I'm going to edit this as well I'm going to change this here as well number three setting up your profile and then we're going to do that save it okay so I'm going to have to do the same thing after I've updated the make sure all the lessons are the right lessons 
uh, but now I have all the lessons I can create other lessons I'm going to do number four oh, I'm pressing the wrong thing here number four is this one let's leave it number five is this one add a new lesson there we go number six so let's just create them all add a new lesson number seven and number is that it publish the course oh that's it okay so back to the course now now the default would without me editing anything is just whatever was in the um setting up your profile becoming an affiliate creating a course adding it looks like there's something missing because I have so introduction how to register oh is that what I had so introduction registering setting okay yeah okay so now I have them all here <coughs> um <coughs> I want to edit the text of all of those so if I want to change this one this one this one show you how to register your account this one here I'm going to go back to here and I'm going to say setting up your profile the first thing thing you'll want to do do is set up your profile for success right so in this lesson whoops in this lesson we show you what you'll want to change in your profile to so that so that your students know who know what you're about what you're about <clears throat> that's it for now I'm just going to save it and uh, back to list this one here is the becoming an affiliate become an affiliate becoming an affiliate okay so if you want to to receive income from Quickie Course you need, you need to be an affiliate we walk you through the process of becoming, becoming an affiliate and why right so that's the one here back to list uh, I can just go to the course here if I click on course it shows me this becoming an affiliate let's edit this one as well so creating creating a course before before you can you can upload lessons for videos for lessons videos for lessons you need to create the course itself the course is the container that the lessons and the videos will be tied to once created okay so that's the course and then the last one here is going to be I go back to the course now we have adding a lesson so adding adding a lesson
course is not of any use without a lesson so we show you how to add a lesson how to add a lesson to a course click course right so when you add a course and click it I'm terrible at writing the right text here and all that but this is just to kind of give you an, an idea and if I go back to the course here now I have a final one and I'm gonna oh I forgot to publish this one let's publish it sorry about my sniffles uh the course back to the course the last one here is this one's not published either let's publish that uh, back to the course and one last thing here this one here is publish the course so publish the course publish publishing the course you'll need to publish the course if you want others to buy it okay so we show you how to publish a course you can publish to public to members or just make it a hidden link okay there we go so now we have the lessons of course the course itself is you know kind of bogus because it's not really complete but what I'm doing here is now I'm gonna actually publish this course if I just go and edit the course again right here I can see under access that it's can only access with special link if I just say public and done now it's a public course so this is a free course that's public so creating your first course oh look at that I, I missed let's edit that and fix that your first course done there you go and there you go so now it's creating your first course so that becomes a link to your course oh actually you can't see that right the link to your course is that up here and so now the course is published and that's kind of how you create a course from videos you've got to split the video up you got to upload the videos and then you got to create the skeleton of the course right you got to have the course and then in the course you need the lessons where's my mouse there's my mouse so in the course you need the lesson so once you have the lessons in the course it becomes a course people can actually add the add it to their library they can actually go watch the videos and that's kind of how you do it so now if I go to this link here and I want to make this actually you know what I want to make all this a free course that's available to anybody even though they don't uh they, whether they have the access so what I can do is I go to each of these I'm going to make this free access yes I'm going to go to the next one well I can do it back to list and see how it says free access yes here I can just edit this this one's done second one back to list here this third one here yes and this one back to list uh, this one over here yes it'd be nice if I could just edit the whole thing right that's one of the things I'd like to implement as a feature right here where you can just edit these directly but that's not implemented yet but we'll do that at some point for sure because this is certainly annoying to have to go back and go through and all that right would be nice to just be able to edit these things here directly so there you go so now the course is public so now if I go back to this course here course now that this is the course if I take this link and I open up a new incognito window which would be the same as somebody coming to the site from 
uh, somewhere else I just put the link in here right that course is now accessible to anybody that wants it so they can actually watch the lessons and it doesn't matter it's going to skip over now let's turn this a little intro video that's the difference right if you don't have an account you're going to see this all the time and actually I can go and let's see what happens if I I can actually edit this course and I can uh, uh no actually no I no 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 I was going to say something but uh, show ads I can remove the ads and see how the ads are on the side here I think that works yeah see now they're they're gone right there's no ads in this course it's a free course so I don't why would I want ads we'll go to the end here and the link uh there so so that shows the now obviously it's not the right video I got to go fix that but that's how you create a course <clears throat> that from Click eCourse from a video that you have a long video a 30 minute video you got to split it up in the right sequence and then you just create a course with all these different lessons in it so it's as simple as that I mean it takes a bit to go through and do it all but that's how you create a course from a video all right hopefully you enjoyed this and we'll see you in the next episode this has been Course Income Secrets, the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Ooh. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.